Hi, today we're going to talk about how to spot a rip current. Now all beaches are different and not all beaches have rips. And even rip currents can look different. But there's certain things that you can look for that you can help, help you spot them. One common characteristic about rip currents is that they often look like these dark gaps between areas of white water or breaking waves. So look at the water for 5 to 10 minutes for these dark clear gaps going through the surf. Rips also move water pretty fast. They can move things like, like sand, like seaweed, like jellyfish, so you look for moving objects. And rips also take water one way, whereas waves bring it back, and that makes the water surface look a little bit different, a little bit bumpy at times. So those are the three things you look for. If you're not sure how to spot a rip, the best thing to do is always swim between the red and yellow flags, which are set up away from rip currents.